Welcome to Analyst World. Today, we're going to unbox and set up a Sony Bravia XRX 90 J 65 inches 4K Smart TV. Okay, I'm excited. Let's do it. All right, there you go. All right, all right. Snip, snip, snip. Okay, here is your setup guide. Make sure you read it before you start setting up your new TV. So in here we have the power cord, we have the remote, and we have the battery for the remote, and we have the manuals. Make sure you read the manuals. Okay, here's the leg. And here's the other leg. All right. Okay. This one too. Hmm. Voila. Voila. Be because the, uh, box, the box Put it there. Yeah. I think let's move it out, out, out. out. Take this one off. So you have to take the cardboard off away from the foam. Just easy. Just flip this one. And there's another one in the middle. And another one over here. There you go. Same thing on the other side. There you go. I would cut all these tapes. This tape is holding from here to the other side. Of course, the, in the video, they just do it to show it slurry smooth, but they did something behind the scene. Well, that behind the scenes is important. Okay. <laughs> so. 
so okay i'm just gonna explain to you that if it, it's easier if you this foam is one piece all the way so what we did we cut this one slowly carefully so you cut this one and then you cut the other side there and also on the other side the purpose with that is you have to lift one side of this to take this one off and then you put one leg and you do it on the other side too we'll show it next okay So you want to put this one back and do it again or not? Okay. No? No, no. Okay. Okay. It's, it's right on your hand there. Yeah, it's right here. Right where my finger is. Right there. there you go. That's the right spot. Yeah. There you go. So that doesn't come out, it locks in? Yep. Good? Yep. Good. Just trying to uh, not to uh, do the... Okay, I'm going to move, move it a bit. Gonna just okay. There you go. There you go. Okay, let's do the other side. Okay, this is the front, so I'm gonna grab. Yeah. I'm gonna grab from the front. I'm gonna grab from here. So I'm gonna show you it here first. <laughs> so there is uh, um, this side is is the left. No, no. It's the left side. Um, make sure that this one is facing inside. This is the, the back of the TV, okay? So make sure this leg is facing, this thing here is facing that side, not like this, okay? So the leg, so the leg on the is on the outside and this one is on the inside. And this is the back of the TV. So you can't use this one on the other side. It's specific for this side, okay? So here we go. We already put the other side. So we're going to do this side. Got it. Now, we can take off this. No. We're trying to fight it. Okay. I'm going to lift this. I want to take okay. it off. Okay? Okay. There you go. Okay. I'm gonna, gonna cut the thing on the bottom. There you go. Voila! So, in the sit up guide, it says that don't touch the screen. So, I'm leaving the cardboard that's covered the screen until we put it up here in the TV stand then we take the cardboard and also not to squeeze so we have to lift it up from the bottom and then we put it up here that's why they showed the video like to, yeah. to grab it like this not to not to squeeze like that you have to so stop it like this from moving the portrait there which I'll list later so we're going to rotate it and put it up there now. yeah before we take it out Okay, so you're gonna. So what we're gonna do is grab it like this. Okay. 
grab it and lean it even back. Okay, but so and then you don't you want to grip like this. Yeah, what you yeah. want to do is lean it. Yeah. The side. Okay. okay, let me go there first. Now. Now that it's unboxed, my hubby will sit up over the wirings. What I like about this, because at the back, there is a clip that will hold all the wirings. It's not scattered all over. And um, this Sony TV, this is the third Sony TV in this household. We have two 40 inches uh, Bravia TV. There was nothing wrong with it. There is nothing wrong with it. We had it for 11 years. We have no problem with it. My hubby just want to upgrade it to a bigger screen and upgraded technology. That's the only reason, the only few reasons. All right, and you will see it. And here we have the back panel of the Sony Bravia XR X90J TV on the top you'll see there's one USB 5 volt 500 milliamp max port and another one is 5 volt 900 milliamp max port. There's a digital audio optical port, a headphone port, there's a video in port and it says video audio LR. There are two standard HDMI ports. There's a HDMI eARC slash ARC 4K 120 hertz port. There's another HDMI uh, 4K 120 hertz port. There's a networking LAN port or RS-232C port or IRN. These are for remote. And there's also a cable uh, input port. The power cord for this TV is located on the back panel on the left. So here's the remote for the TV. It has some special buttons on it. There actually is a YouTube button. Netflix, Disney, and Prime Video. So when you push on it, it brings you to that app. And we use all of those, so it's excellent. There's also a voice search button, so you can put your commands in there through voice. Here's some of the various screens. This is the For You menu. This is the Movies menu. This is the Shows menu. Here's the Apps menu. And there's the library screen. This is part of the settings uh, screen. In here you can do a lot of changes and uh, it's quite easy to use. This is one of the screen savers. 
The screensavers are absolutely gorgeous. I have Apple TV and they're great, but this is on another level. This Sony Bravia XJ90 is an excellent TV. It's a smart TV and a Google TV. So you have built-in Google functions and you can use the remote to uh, command. Also, you can command uh, your home, like a smart home as well. It has the smart features in it. Yeah, the picture quality uh, is excellent. Sound is good. Um, you know, there's a lot of features in there I didn't even know about when we purchased the TV that were pleasant surprises. Like, you know, when you're watching Netflix, uh, it switches to uh, Dolby Vision and different things that, like when watching Star Wars, for example, it gives you the perfect uh, picture. It's uh, just a really all-around excellent TV. You can also airplay to the TV. Uh, Apple TV is built in as well, and uh, you can cast to the TV as well. Both my wife and I are very happy with this TV and highly recommend it. We give it a two thumbs up. Voila.